morning. It's uh, wow. Look at my hair. <laughs> I need a I need to get a haircut. But it is my first day off in a long time. Um, I had a busy day yesterday, and I kind of don't know what to do with myself today because I'm so accustomed to working. Uh, let me explain. Also, I haven't used my X100V in a minute. But yeah, it's one of those things where like you're so accustomed to working on projects for clients or, you know, stuff for YouTube or whatever it is that you're currently working on. And then you get so used to it. And so when you have a day off like I do today, you kind of don't know what to do. Like, do you do something productive? to satisfy that creative itch, or do you just rest and just play video games or whatever, so uh, that's kind of like where I'm at right now. But uh, first things first, I need to get out of these PJs and I think I'm just gonna wear a hat today because I don't feel like styling my hair. Uh, so one, one second. All right, nice and dressed, I got my hat on. Also this hat, probably the most durable hat I've ever owned, not sponsored, but yeah, uh, nice little break from styling my hair. All right, had to had to step out because my mom's blasting her her morning routine music, um, and I don't want to get hit with copyright. But also, it's bright as f right now, and I also wanted to see how far I could push the 14 to 35 for vlogging because the other day when I shot that video, I noticed that there was vignetting in the corners uh, be, at 14. Yeah, because I was shooting C-Log 3 at 800 ISO, which is the minimum. But I noticed that there's a way to get around it if you drop the ISO lower than the required amount. And then just dial in the ND filter, so it should look fine. Um, I don't know if my sky is going to get blown out. So here's a test. Hi, this is the sky. And uh, right now my ISO is at 200. Um, pick this up because, again, I wanted to vlog with it. Uh, and just kind of like do something different than POV street photography videos. I've always wanted to vlog, but after using the 24 to 70 for so long and, uh, you know, complaining about how heavy it is, uh, this 14 to 35 is kind of like a, just a huge deal for me because it doesn't weigh a lot, especially with the R6 and just a little microphone I use. So I think it's a good setup. So we'll see how, uh, what kind of stuff I could do with it. My cats want to say hi. This is Sophia. Say hi, baby. Sophia, and then this one right here is Kachan, and their siblings, we rescued them three years ago. Oh, stop it. <laughs> they fight over the windowsill because they love to sunbathe. Also, it's supposed to be cold today, but it's actually quite warm out, so I guess I'm a little over overdressed for the occasion. Like yesterday when I went out to uh, downtown Lakes, I had to go to jury duty. Um, I also got dismissed, so yay. Uh, it was freaking windy and cold, like everywhere, and it was nice, but now it's like, it's starting to feel like summer again. So it's like, I mean, granted we're in spring, I get it, but I kind of want a little bit of consistency in my weather, just like for like a whole week straight, either just all hot or all cold. Preferably the cold because, uh, and if it rains, because I like to shoot in the rain. Uh, you guys know that for a fact. I I really need to move that. Uh, where is it? The C stand right here, so I don't uh, I don't get tripped up. Let's zoom in just a little bit. There we go. Uh, okay, that's good. So I guess the whole point of today's video is to tell you it's okay to take a day off and kind of like rest and go do something else besides creating content, which is ironic because that's exactly what I'm doing right now. I'm making a video to tell you this message, but I guess also in a way to demystify that, like, you know, people online, creatives on Instagram or YouTube are just human. We have our own struggles that we have on a day-to-day -day basis. And, you know, I guess it's also as a reminder to myself to take a day off every now and then, especially when I finish projects, especially when like I invoice my client and I'm getting paid and I have nothing else to worry about. My bills for the month are covered. And that's a struggle that I, I guess I've always had uh, like trouble coming to terms with because like, you know, a couple weeks ago I spent almost 12 hours on the computer editing photos and, and videos for a client and it was just, 
I was just so emotionally and just creatively drained after that like long session. Granted, it paid my bills, but I was just so done with it. And then I had to go do the same thing the following day for another client. And I was just, I'm, I'm just so tired. And so I guess because my mind's constantly set to like, okay, I gotta get this stuff done. I gotta clear my plate so I can go focus and do this stuff for the other client and you know then clear that plate and so on and so forth rinse and repeat so it's really hard for me to i guess like slow down and um you know just rest so i'm gonna do something today which is i'm gonna go play lego star wars because i bought that game and i am loving it so far and uh, yeah so i guess uh this concludes today's video so thank you guys so much for watching again this vlog's been kind of random I'm trying to figure the whole thing out myself. Uh, so let me know what you guys think down below. And thanks again for watching. Hasta luego. Oh yeah, subscribe and do all that stuff. Hasta luego.